My name is Professor Victoria Shannon, and I've been teaching at WNL for about one year. So my research and teaching interests include civil procedure, international arbitration, and a new phenomenon called third-party litigation funding. Third-party funding is a phenomenon whereby an outside entity, like a bank or a hedge fund, invests in the litigation by financing the legal representation of one party to the case. And in exchange, if that party wins the case, uh, they receive a fee from uh, the party out of the funds that they receive from the loser of the case. And so for them, it's an investment. And this creates a whole host of uh, interesting ethical questions and logistical questions with respect to how our dispute resolution system works. Well, attorneys have ethical obligations to their client. Their primary loyalty should be to their client, and they can be sanctioned or disbarred uh, if they do not follow their client's wishes. So you could have a tug of war between what the client wants and what the funder wants. And so this is one example of a potential ethical conflict that could arise. So I teach civil procedure to first year students. And this year I'm also teaching a small legal writing section along with civil procedure. Civil procedure is essentially the way our court system works. What are the rules that the parties have to follow when presenting their cases? And what are the rules that the judge enforces during the courtroom proceedings and also outside of the courtroom? And this has been a wonderful experience for me, particularly since these uh, small sections are very intimate and I get to know all the students very well. And it's really more like a discussion rather than a lecture class because I only have about 17 students. And so it's been really wonderful. And so I'm able to connect civil procedure to legal writing and I think the students understand both better. Well, I think first year students are so unique in that they are bringing with them the experiences that they had during their undergraduate education. And so when they're coming to law school, we're essentially opening a new world to them and teaching them a new way to see the world and evaluate problems that they see in society, in people's lives, uh, with the way cases are decided. And we're teaching them to question. And that's something that I think first year students in particular uh, really blossom when they learn about the questioning nature of the law. Uh, in many of their undergraduate courses, there was a right answer, a correct answer, and it was very concrete. And we teach them to become more, more comfortable with the fuzziness, the gray areas, the difficulties, and the hard questions in the law. And I think that that is a truly rewarding experience both for them and for us as professors.